when the Northern Irish state was created more than a century ago, it was, it was deliberately engineered to ensure that it would have a forever unionist majority. And that, as you say, is now it's gone. gone. And Sinn Féin isn't just leading in the north of Ireland. Sinn Féin is now the largest political party right across Ireland. I'm the leader of the opposition in Parliament in Dublin, in the Dáil. So given that Ulster is now led by Sinn Féin, yes. question stands, how long before we have a united Well, I, I believe that we're going to have referendums on unity in this decade. I believe the constitutional arrangement will change, and I believe that we all need to prepare for that. Gosh. I also believe that we shouldn't come at this with the sense of dread or fear or loss. We need to look at this as an incredible democratic opportunity. Partition has been disastrous for Ireland. It's been disastrous for Britain as well. We've had division, we've had conflict, but we've also had now almost a quarter of a century of a very robust peace process. And the time is now looming where we bring this journey to its conclusion, an end of partition, a reunified Ireland in peace and security and with a good neighbourly strong relationship with Britain our next door neighbour. And let's face it, there's a huge Irish community here in Britain and I think we have a basis for a very strong, peaceful, orderly relationship. But the, the preparation mm. needs to start now. I mean, mm. there will be no prize for anybody burying their head yeah, uh, in the uh, sand. You, you